so there was a time uh, when you go back in time say about 5 to 10 years from now there were crt tvs that is cathode ray televisions calling it technically good afternoon shubha madhyana and elrugo namaskara i am akarsh welcome to a fresh new vlog the date today is 18th may 2020 it is around uh, 3:30 pm in the afternoon so today's video is going to be a tech hack or a how to or whatever you want to call it you can take it so today i'll be talking about uh, the common term tv so all of us are very familiar with the tv or the so called uh, television now some of us have smart tvs at home where we enjoy a lot of stuff on uh, different uh, platforms such as amazon prime video you have your netflix youtube spotify and all that stuff right so there was a time uh, when you go back in time say about 5 to 10 years from now there were crt tvs that is cathode ray televisions calling it technically so these tvs many of us including me still use it in your home right just because you can't throw away your old tv just because a new one came out so i have a hack for all of you so we are in, including me i was under a general perception that old tvs are only meant for cable watching and you can't enjoy your uh, today's services like uh, youtube or amazon prime video which all of us enjoy watching so today's video is going to be on how to convert or change your old tv that looks like a dubba or box that we call uh, generally crt tv into a today's uh, smart tv to enjoy youtube amazon prime video netflix and watch all those shows and series and enjoy and watch me as well so let's go ahead now many of you might have this question or in your mind while you're watching this like we can just buy a fire tv stick or apple tv or many others out there and just put it plug it into your tv and then enjoy content but what if your tv doesn't have an hdmi port that is high definition media input port that is you remember the old three pin that we used to play video games in the red white and green or the red white and yellow pins and your tv has that and not the hdmi this video is for all of you now i am going to give you a hack which does not involve any connector that is which converts your three pin into hdmi port because that is very shitty i have tried that and i have been fed up i have literally tried all the possible hacks and this is the best one that after a uh, detailed research that i have practically tried out this is the best one uh, you can do it out there to change your uh, old tv into a smart tv for enjoying content now to make that hack possible we'll be needing a hardware right for any change to be possible in terms of electronics you need either a hardware implementation or a software implementation so technically speaking it is not possible to do that with a piece of software so we'll be requiring a hardware equipment it is basically a set top box uh, it is called airtel extreme set top box it is from airtel yeah the one who provides cellular data mobile services and uh, stuff like that it is airtel so this device is very niche and it is very handy and uh, trust me this is the best out there in the market that can that can let you watch all the your latest platforms as amazon prime video netflix even on an old tv which is which ages back to as old as say 10 to 15 years from now yes that is possible and i have tried it and it works perfectly fine so generally every tv if we have a tv will be having a set top box right yeah set top box is made mandatory now so we will be having a set top box uh, to watch different channels and all all stuff like that so the only thing you have to compromise is change your set top box that you have right now to an airtel extreme set top box so with that you can enjoy uh, all the content uh, and you can turn your uh, old crt tv into a smart tv now how is that possible now what airtel extreme set top box does is before tell before telling you what it does i'll tell you what it is it's basically a set top box it's called a smart set top box that is it comes with the wifi with which you can connect to internet and then from there you can stream services so what it basically uh, does is it connects to your tv with the three pin or if you have hdmi port you can connect it with hdmi port as well so it doesn't require any connector because the set top box itself comes uh, built in with the three ports so it has two types of inputs 
one is your old three pin input and the other one is hdmi input so whichever is feasible for you and whichever your tv supports you can use that for this uh, setup box so i have since i'm talking about the old tvs i'll be showing you the three pin setup box that i use the airtel extreme setup box with the three input terminal yeah so you can connect the three pin from your tv to this now we all use setup boxes with our tv right that's how we can watch tv practically so we'll be having a setup box now talking about this hack this hack will require a bit of compromise a very small compromise but a handy one and a much useful one so what is the compromise about well you have to change your existing tv setup box into the airtel extreme setup box that i was talking about yeah so airtel extreme setup box is nothing but a basic it is called a smart setup box what is a smart setup box generally speaking the word smart refers to anything which can connect to internet so in that reference this setup box also connects to internet and uh, that is how you're going to enjoy all your uh, smart content such as youtube amazon prime video and netflix and whatnot smart setup box basically anything that you can do with a smart tv you can do with this all you need is the setup box the connection of the setup box and the wi-fi connection or a internet connectivity to the setup box okay that is the complete hack only that is the compromise that you'll be needing which can convert your existing tv into a smart tv for enjoying content so let me talk about the steps because uh, generally speaking any tech hack when you refer to or uh, how to will have steps i'm already started laughing but uh, yeah so talking about the steps the first step will be uh, changing your old setup box into a edel extreme setup box that is uh, purchasing a new connection of uh, airtel extreme so how much is this going to cost well generally speaking it is not much with the market price out there uh, presently as i checked the price is somewhere around 2500 to 3000 rupees and you will be getting one month of uh, free subscription so that is very nice so you get the connection that is the first step second step is uh, connect your setup box to your wi-fi connection or internet connectivity you can do it either using a lan cable if you don't have a wi-fi wi connection back home or you can just uh, connect it to your wi-fi without internet it is not possible to enjoy any platform because all the platforms that i talked about let it be youtube uh, amazon prime video or uh, netflix anything requires internet connection right it will be uh, it is not going to make sense without any what it is not going to make sense of asking a question of what of as to what do i do if i don't have an internet connection basically you can't watch content without internet let it be anywhere on your smartphone as well if you don't have an internet connection you can't watch so an internet connection is must we, that gives you two options you can either have a lan connection that is when you don't have a wi-fi router and you just have a modem you can connect your setup box through lan cable and if you have a Wi-Fi connection or Wi-Fi router, you can connect your setup box to the Wi-Fi modem and then enjoy content. That's it. Those are the steps. Get a new connection, connect it to your internet, enjoy the content. Now, talking about the subscription charges of the setup box, Airtel doesn't uh, charge you externally extra for the for streaming the services, other services that comes with the setup box because basically you're streaming it from the internet. So all you have to do is uh, take a subscription of the channels that you generally watch, uh, that you generally used to watch with the old uh, setup box. The same subscription you can continue it over. Or if you're using the setup box only to stream uh, content on uh, internet platforms, then you can just take the minimum package available with very less number of channels. Now you may have this question to ask me as to why this tech hack, or what is the use of this tech hack? How is it going to benefit me? Now suppose let's say you want to watch content on Amazon Prime Video or Netflix. Many new series are coming up every day, many new TV shows are coming up, uh, new movies are there within no time of their release in the theatres and all that stuff is happening and you have an averagely old TV that is good, still in condition and it is good and it is working fine and you enjoy the TV but the only problem is you don't know how to enjoy your content that you're watching on your smartphone or laptop onto your tv because bigger the screen it is better right you can immerse yourself into the experience of watching it with a more effectful uh, experience so that is where this tech hack comes in very handy with the use of just 3000 rupees you can convert any of your tv let it be 
very old also if it just has a three input terminal that you can turn your tv into a smart tv for enjoying now there is no point in making a tech hack video without showing you how that works so let me show you how it works so this is the front of the front view of the extreme setup box as you can see there's a android uh, symbol right here so which means that it is a smart setup box uh, based on an android operating system it also supports uh, dolby audio as well as you can see it so as you can see this is the airtel extreme setup box that i'm using to convert this tv into a smart tv so the tv that i sh just showed you is a crt tv so as you can see I have used the old 3 pin that is the yellow, white and red instead of HDMI. As I told earlier, you can use an HDMI if you have the feasibility to use one. But since my TV doesn't have an HDMI port, I am using the 3 pin input terminal. So this is the remote that you will be getting with the extreme setup box. Now one more good thing about this is you will be getting a universal remote that you can pair it up with your uh, TV as well. So this remote can be used to turn on your TV and control the volumes and basic functionalities of your TV as well as control your uh, new setup box as well. And boom I'm back after the showing you the tech hack right. Now I hope you enjoy the tech hack. I hope it will be useful for you. If you don't have an old TV and if you have a friend or a relative or anyone you know who has an old TV and struggling with the same problem as this one, do share the video with them. I hope it is useful for them. Now why did I make this video? For the past 2-3 years I was struggling for this hack. Now I have tried out all hacks. I have tried out the HDMI connector pin, uh, bringing out an external amplifier, connecting it that to the TV and then using an optical fiber to connect your uh, Apple TV or your Amazon Fire Stick with a external device and then connecting that to the amplifier. All that I've tried out, I've ruled out everything. This is the only one that works perfectly fine. As you saw, my TV is the one which doesn't have a HDMI connection. It is a very old TV and yet it is perfect. With Airtel Extreme Setup Box, I just turned that TV into a smart TV. Now, thank you for watching the video. Do give it a like if you found it useful. Now, before going, before ending the vlog, I'm planning out to start motor vlogging as well. Do comment down below if you think I should. Obviously, I will be starting out very soon because I've ordered all the equipment and it's on the way. So, <laughs> I'll be starting out soon. So, with that said, thank you for watching. See you. Bye.